Dave Narone out here in uh, Squamish, BC on a beautiful morning. Just went for a little bit of a swim and uh, I'm on the 49 lift coil. And as you can tell, I'm running the blowfish uh, this morning. So I tried it quickly last night. We had some uh, early kick on a 5.4 and I was like, so impressed with it. Now, for those of you who are looking to get out with your dog or kids or do some adventures, like you can camp off this thing now. Um, and uh, But you still have the board that you want and you need. Now I ride a 5049 because um, I live right on the ocean. It gets uh, racks up pretty good with swell and chop and wind and I also teach. So it's kind of the, the best of both worlds. I can rip on this board when I want. I can teach on it, especially now with the blowfish. So first impressions, uh, super easy to pump up and put on your board. Um, when you, and attach and also take it off. So that's really important because I can take the kids out, come back, rip the, uh, the board, the, the blowfish off, and now I have my board on and ready to go uh, rip. So super, super cool there. And it's a very simple product. Like everything that Lyft does, um, you know, it's kind of everything that, you know, costs a little bit more or, or takes a little more time is in the end result is more simple. So, um, but riding this board, it's funny, with uh, with the blowfish on, it feels just like your regular board for carving and stuff. But obviously there is a little more swing weight, but it is nowhere near if you went to a bigger board. Like I've taught on some six foot boards. When you get them out of the water, they're really, the swing weight is really quite dramatic. Um, but the blowfish is light as a product on its own. So adding it to your, uh, your foil is super easy. And uh, you know, just you can just carve super easy on it. I'm gonna put it down on the water right now, and so uh, a little bit of a rough. One. So now you can see I'm just cruising along, and you know now my eight-year-old can ride the e-foil and doesn't have to worry about um, you know kids on e-foils are pretty easy because they're light, but this just makes the experience so much easier. And if someone doesn't want a foil, you can just ride it around like this. So it's really, really cool and serves a lot of different purposes. And I think they're really smart because um, although there is a cost to the blowfish, it's really inexpensive considering what it is. And it's way less expensive than starting on a big board and then a month later wanting to have a smaller board. You can get the smaller board that you want, put the blowfish on and learn and start really easily and have a great time and not even get wet come out here and just slide it around on this. Um, so I can, I'm gonna stop. Okay, let's stop. Okay, so I'm, I'm now stopped. And uh, I can stand on this five, uh, or those four nine board. So as you can see, I mean, you could, you could fish, you could hang out here, you could go for a swim, and then basically start back up. And uh, you do need to counter a little bit more forward, I find, than when you're without the blowfish. But that's uh, really easy to do, and we're back up foiling. So it's that simple. So just super cool. And uh, yeah, if you're looking for to get your kids or your dog on your e-foil, then um, this is the way to do it. And it really makes a lot of sense. I actually can't wait to teach on this because it's now a guarantee that people are going to stand up right away. Um, and it just makes the, the ease of entrance into the sport uh, a lot easier. And that's great. More people out enjoying the water, especially on a, on a foil. So thank you, Lyft, for making such great products. I mean, in the summertime, uh, I go e-biking in the morning and then e-foiling in the after, in the, uh, right after that. So it's not even 10 o'clock yet, and uh, I'm going to be out for another 20k and and uh, as you can see we got Hell Sound and the Lila in the background and uh, the whales and humpbacks are around here somewhere so I might get lucky and spot them. We'll see you out on the water! <laughs>